Hey, God bless you, my friend and sister Sharon. And today I wanted to invite you very brief and quickly to go over to my website, motivatingyoutowin.com and pick up my book. It is a free download, Overcoming the Battlefield of the Mind. I have been receiving a lot of correspondence and emails from you, uh, from a lot of you. And I wanted to remind you that this book in particular, the first half of this book, which is 160 pages, deals with how to get and how to harness your thought life. And then the second half of this book, it will teach you about the comforter, the Holy Spirit, who is my partner in ministry. He is my comforter. He's been my, 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 my teacher, my everything. So I talk extensively about the Holy Spirit in the second half of this book. Go to my website, my friend. I want to encourage you, my friend. We got to stop the whining. No whining. We got to stop murmuring and complaining. We got to start recycling all of our pain daily because when you get a pile up, my friend, and you don't allow God to, to, to recycle your frustration, your pain, and your fears, it's like dirty clothes. If you keep on throwing them clothes over in that basket before you know it, my friend, you got to pile up and, and it's harder to take it out. It's, it, it, it can become burdensome. So God is saying, Look, it's time for us to take some of this trash out, get rid of some of this old stuff that's bombarding our hearts and our minds. So go to my website, get your free book download, Motivating You to Win, Overcoming the Battlefield of the Mind. God bless you, my friend. Go get your book. Right now, they are only available in uh, um, a free download, okay? But send it to your friends, your family, anybody you know that's struggling with suicidal thoughts, if you're struggling with constant heaviness, if you're, if you're constantly struggling with unforgiveness, bitterness, anger, lust, whatever it is, friend, there is a word from God. All right, my friend, I love you. Till next time, be blessed.